what's causing that financial stress and what's the plan for moving on from that? What's your plan for recovery? So the key thing that's come out of that is that there are uh, three main consequences if you don't take action, if you don't you know, identify what the causes are and you don't put in place a plan to move forward. And the three consequences of that is that, well, you're not going to know where you are at financially, where your business is at and how healthy or unhealthy it is or what cash flow issues you've got coming up. Are you actually managing your cash flow? There's going to be a lot of things that you just aren't aware of. And that uncertainty actually causes stress in a lot of areas, um, particularly in your in your personal life, particularly if you've got other commitments on um, maybe your mortgage on your house, you know, you know, education costs or just day to day living costs with, with interest rates rising. So looking at what can we do there to eliminate that financial uncertainty. The other th second one that if you don't actually take steps now to identify what's wrong with your business or, or why it's not performing is that you may miss other opportunities. So we'll see in the past couple of years, we've seen a lot of those businesses that are actually thriving at the moment. They were in a position to take advantage of opportunities that arose. Now, if you're not on top of where your business is at financially, you're not on top of your business health, you don't have a current plan of how you're going to move it forward, you're going to continue to miss those opportunities. And if you're missing those opportunities, but your competitors are taking up those opportunities, well, they're going to continue to go forward and succeed. And they're going to take more of the market share. That means your business is actually going to start suffering even more. So we need to get your business in a position where you can take advantage of those missed opportunities. And the third th consequence there is that really, if you don't take action now to address those issues, then you're going to be left with a business that's not efficient, not generating cash, not generating profit. And without actually having a plan, you're not going to, you're not going to do it. It's like saying, I, I want to start running but you don't actually have any specific plan. It's not a case of, well, I'm going to meet up with, with my friend and, and go for a run on Tuesday morning. And he's going to be there to, to keep me accountable for that. Without a plan to do something and some de definite actions, you're not going to move that forward. 